Can Vital Reboters be the key to restore success at Williams? Now we all know that Valtteri um, Valtteri Bottas has had quite a lot of success at Mercedes, but we also know that um, it's more than likely that um, Valtteri Bottas um, will be replaced by um, George Russell um, in 2021. I want to give you a quote from um, Total Wolf about. George R R Russell, and then I will give you a quote from Claire Claire Williams about um, Valtteri Bottas and what she said um, when Valtteri left the team. Total Wolf said about George Russell, he said, because you're being put in a ca in a car that is able to win races and championships, a high pressure environment. I think it can be it can go terribly wrong for a young driver that has the talent to become a world champion if if he's thrown into that environment next to the best driver of his generation who has been with us for seven years and I wouldn't want to burn George. I think I think it could come too early and on top of that I tr I try to respect to be respectful to all contracts we sign we sign and we signed a contract we we knew what we were doing with Williams and this is where he's going to learn yeah i agree with toto that if you would put put um, George Russell into the um, the Mercedes team in 2020 i think it was it would be too early. Um, however, I believe in 2021 he 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 would have had enough um, chance to adapt himself to Formula One, and I think uh, he he would be ready to make the step up. Um, yes, and uh, yeah. So I reckon that is what's gonna happen. Um, I also reckon that there will be a swap around between Valtteri Bottas and and uh, George Russell. Um, kind of a bit like um, Valtteri Bottas coming back to where to the team that gave him his break. And I think um, um, Claire Williams would be uh, more than happy to have him back. Uh, as the, I think that the, the following quote from her demonstrates. Bear in mind that this quote is an old quote, but I think it sums up um, the relationship that, um, or the higher regard that Valtteri um, and Claire have for each other. She's she when back in 2017, she said Valtteri has been an important part of Williams. He's got that fiery passion that you want in a driver because all he wants to do is be in the best car and win. When when you when you have a driver that you know that's all he wants to do, that that's all they want, why force them to race in your car? That's not the right thing to do. We we stood in Valtteri's way once when Ferrari came along and I made a promise to Valtteri that I wouldn't stand in his way again. Again, I honor my promises. He has, he has an amazing opportunity and it will be interesting to see how Valtteri does this year. I don't think you are given the possibility to learn in a Mercedes. Because he has got the tenacity, he's got the knowledge, and he wants to help out Williams, I do believe. And uh, also, I think he wants to help Williams um, get back to top. Um, and also, I think because he's a loyal person, and I think he he re rem remembers the promise that... Um, Clear mate to him, um, so um, and I really do believe that with him at the helm, that uh, Williams could fight uh, them 
themselves up the grid and you know in 2021 because at the end of the day 2021 is a major major rule uh, change and uh, you know they could be the the ones in getting getting the rule getting the rules right um i think with with his knowledge that he will have gained at wilds driving alongside lewis hamilton um and at mercedes i think he can transfer some of that uh, to the williams crew and yes so that's why i think he is the right man um to bring to bring williams um, back towards the front of the grid and f maybe fighting for podiums and maybe even wins uh, from 2021 onwards so uh, anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this video i've i've certainly enjoyed making it um so if you like what you see then uh don't forget to like comment and subscribe um and um i shall see you very soon cheers for watching Bye guys, bye.